Hey, what's going on, guys? We're here uh, in Lancaster, PA, day of the show. Um, we're going to do some rounds of posing with my coach, IFBB Pro Jason Arntz. Um, and we'll, we'll run through that now. Just do a front relax shot. There you go. Cover his elbows a little bit, chest up. Good. Go ahead and go front bicep. Hey guys, we're here. We're about 30 minutes from hitting the stage. We're just kind of relaxing now before we get out there, kind of going over a few things. Uh, right now, my confidence is pretty high. I feel pretty good. It's probably my best look to date. Um, I think we'll do pretty well uh, showing. Energy levels aren't too bad. Uh, I'm not full of energy, but I'm not, I'm not dead. Uh, kind of starting to get a little excited, so I think that's kind of get me through any low energy that I may have. Um, so we're gonna start we'll probably in a couple minutes here, eat some uh, food, kind of carve up a little bit more, head downstairs, wait it out, and uh, we'll do our pump up and hit the stage and hopefully, uh, hopefully coach will be uh, satisfied with what we do today. I'm tough to please, but uh, no, he looks great. Best I've seen him. Um, he's going to make a good showing, and uh, hopefully just uh, get that qualification for uh, for this coming week for the juniors. That's that's the main goal here, but uh, he's uh, come a long way. Looking forward to seeing him in about 30, 45 minutes. So what did you guys change this year, this prep, do you think, made him look? Attitude. Attitude? All attitude. <laughs> okay. it's, all, it's all in the aura. All the attitude and mindset. <laughs> No, we kept him. We, we kept him on a more of a well balanced diet uh, okay. all the way through. You know, with uh, looking to see how his body reacts. You know, it's all about how his body reacts. You know, and th there's nothing set in stone. There's no rules. It's uh, every body is different. So you have to take a, a foundation and, and apply that to to his type, and um, it worked well. You know, so. You know, I was talking to him last night about this. I don't think he flattened out once during this process. He was able to, you know, burn body fat, maintain muscle mass, and actually probably make some improvements during this preparation. So uh, I'm proud of him. Looking forward to seeing him in about 30 minutes. What are we doing now? We're waiting for the elevator now. Hey, it's way like another hour. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I wonder if that guy uh, caught the other one. He didn't go find it. Yeah, the other one was running away. You mean, you mean Orlando?
feeling, Mike? Feeling pretty good. Looking pretty good. Yeah, we're ready. We're ready. Definitely ready. What's up, man? You killed it out there, dude. Killed it. stage here at uh, Pennsylvania Muscle. Feel really good, it was just me and one other guy, but it was one of the best guys I know, Troy Ben. Uh, we were able to share a stage together. Um, I think I did pretty well, I think we both did really well. So it's gonna be uh, a close one in the end, but uh, you know, wherever it goes, I think it goes to the right person. We both brought our A game today. Uh, overall though, I feel fantastic. Uh, feel good doing this show and then following up next week at Juniors. Tighten up a little bit more, fix a few more things, and I think we're, we're going to be really good to go. We're at uh, Longhorn Steakhouse, grabbing a little meal between uh, pre-judging and the finals tonight. Uh, try to get a little steak and maybe a baked potato. Watch everybody else drink water and eat good food. You gonna tell us what that first bite tastes like? Steak. <laughs> Cow. It took very, long enough. Very long. It's a little dry. A little dry, it's all right. It'll be okay. Thanks. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> no, it's good. How's yours? Juicy? It's dead. It's definitely dead. Okay, and, uh, good. Cooked. They prepared it. I didn't want to send it back again because it might take longer. The third, I think they, there's probably shoe or foot on this one. A nice little sweet potato. Oh, not sweet potato, regular potato. Regular potato. What'd you get? I got a burger and I got a sweet potato, but I think there's more butter than sweet potato. Yeah, it's for a little butter. I was like, butter, butter, butter. <laughs> How you feeling now? Like I need a nap. Pour some water? Pour water, yeah. I like to bathe in some ice water. Take a nap. <laughs> uh, and then we got to go to finals at 3 o'clock. 3 o'clock. What do finals look like now? since post-COVID and all that. Is it just the same, just a routine for like 70 seconds? That's what I believe, that they're still doing the same. Uh, it was a little different today with the uh, pre-judging, having a little 30-second pose. Uh, they told me it's not your routine, but you just do what you want to do for 30 seconds before you pose down with everybody else, which that was new to me. It's just so strange. Uh, yeah, they said that uh, that's a new thing, trying to give everybody uh, more time on the stage. More time on the stage. 
So I guess I can respect that. How do you feel about that, Coach? I uh, I'm, a, I'm embarrassed to say I missed the first part of the question. <laughs> what was the question? How do you feel that they only give you 30 seconds on stage now? So. I guess technology just keeps advancing. They used to give us a minute, now they, they got it down where they could get it all done in 30 seconds, but you know, they're trying to speed things up with, uh, with going on with the pandemic, so you gotta take the good with the bad. We're happy the shows are going on, things are opening up. Um, but it's all about competing. You know, obviously that's for the crowd, um, but you know, it's the pose downs and the comparisons of the athletes, you know, we anticipate for. And of course, you know, now with, uh, you know, people trying to build their markets and, and build their name and build a platform for themselves. So, you know, when they have more time to perform on stage, the, the better they, they can showcase themselves. It helps their, uh, their following and their viewers and their uh, supporters, and it helps grow their own individual businesses. So hopefully it gets better. All right, and how was your food? My food was uh, done. It was uh, good. It was, was dead, right? It was dead. It was you, dead. Did but you was... like the broccoli? Because it looks like it. I like the broccoli. I'm sure some of it's still probably in my teeth. Um, I'll get that later. But uh, it was prepared. Prepared. Took a while. It took a while. They're it was slower cool. out here in PA. I don't know why. But today it took like uh, 40 minutes. That's well, because they're so busy. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. Yeah, they're really. All these happy. people. They're so busy. What is that? 45 yeah. minutes. Is that what it was? A party? They, that's what they told us originally. What's that thing you, you put a bad uh, note in? What's it called? Uh, on Yelp? Yelp. I'm definitely going to put a Yelp in for the Yelp uh, time. review. You know, it took a little while. Yeah. Unless they were looking for cows to cook. Um, I think they just wanted, you know, to match the same color as Mike. You know, they wanted just the right amount. They, ro they wanted real meat. Yeah, like, there you go. Like myself. Well, you would think they rush us out of the shows because of COVID. You think they'd want to rush us out of the restaurants and feed us as quick as possible. But of course, no. Everybody has their own, uh, everybody has their own way of doing things. It's not Jersey, I can tell you that much. It's not Jersey. But we don't discriminate against PA. We, we still love PA. Of course. Even though New Jersey is probably the, I, I read this, one of the most hated states in the country. I wonder why. I don't know. Maybe don't, Jersey Shore did it. I was thinking that. That's... Jersey Shore. Dude, that's definitely got what where it started. in it? Gotti, Jersey Shore. Dude, they weren't even from Jersey. Sopranos. Those are good. Those are good movies. Those All right, good Sopranos. Series. I'll give you. Right. All right, but Shame on Jersey you. Shore fucked it up. Jersey Shore. Everybody always says I look like I'm from Jersey Shore. I'm I not. I can see that. I yeah, can see that. Too. I was thinking it when we were talking about it, but I was like, I'm not gonna. <laughs> He's like, oh, it's my camera guy. I don't yeah, want to mention no, this. You know, he'll I mean, edit it out. I'll put it in there. He used, he used to be a personal camera guy to Mike the Situation. Yeah. He went to jail, so now Broad fits out here. That's right. And I'm just killing it. Right. And everyone's like, aren't you from Jersey? I said, yeah, I'm from New Jersey. Not <laughs> a good representation of uh, the real people of Jersey. You know, we care for our neighbors. You know, possibly a, uh, one of the highest tax tax states in the in the, in the country. Of course. But uh, you know, good school and good education. What's going on, dude? How you feel, dude? Uh, I feel pretty good. You look good out there, I feel dude. Pretty good. Just hoping for a little bit of a better outcome right there, but I felt good. Felt like I he had to earn it. Of course. He had to earn it. Give him a run for his money, right? Alright. Best I could do that. But a little dehydrated right now. Get a little water in here. And we'll go again in about five days. Try again. Dude, it was so close. You were so good. Good job, man. Dude, that was so awesome though. I loved every moment of it. <laughs> Me too. Oh, so close. That was an epic battle though. Between you guys, it was crazy. See, it's weird because you like you don't know that. Oh God. Like oh my when you're God. on the stage, you like easily have the best back, mix of like back, That's what sure. yeah. Oh, I thought you had it. Yeah, your back was way better. Oh, yeah. well, on the back, I used the other tall kid was in there, and one of these coaches talking, and we're like, this coach was like, dude, like, have to. All right, we're gonna update you guys today. We got the first place in the heavyweight division, and I think we had a pretty, uh, pretty tough, close call on the overall. Uh, so now we're gonna go, we're gonna go scrub down, get this tan off of me. Uh, call the coach, let him know what's going on, how we did, and see what uh, maybe a little snacks we could find on the way, little crumbs. Should have won, <laughs> but I'm proud of him. It's my wife. 
Thanks, guys. Uh, subscribe, like, comment, share with your friends. We're doing big things. See you.